since since uh would you like to take a moment no 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 i, I just i really hoped zero dawn was a way to undo it all my work and i'm sorry to say i was ever proud of it but tech could really sell a concept and 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 in the labs in the the, the light of creation that first test run when when you saw they understood their own structures could rebuild themselves from memory and light there were no limits god there were no limits okay so that's the way i came in can't get in there to that there's something in there There's a wall here, an uh, invisible wall. I've heard the bad news, and it's all true. The Pharaoh Plague is devouring the biosphere. Life itself will cease to exist. But does that have to be the end? What if we could give life a future? What if we could build a kind of seed from which, on a dead planet, life could blossom anew? This is the aim, the hope, of Project Zero Dawn. To create a super intelligent, fully automated terraforming system and bring life back from lifelessness. What would such a system require? At its core, it would need a true AI, fully capable of making the trillions of decisions necessary to reconstitute the biosphere. An immortal guardian, devoted to the reflourishing of life. We call it Gaia. Mother Nature as an AI. But that's just the core of the system. She will need to be surrounded and empowered by a comprehensive suite of subordinate functions. Think of them as extensions of Gaia's mind, each dedicated to a specific purpose. Now these aren't AIs, but make no mistake, each presents an engineering challenge more profound than anything the human species has ever before attempted. Hardware that preserves and then gestates the billions of seeds and embryos from which life will be reborn. The construction of underground facilities to hold it all. And that's just the start. We don't have to build the entire system. The beauty of a fully automated terraforming system is that it can build itself. Now over the days to come, you'll learn how all these functions, all these pieces that you'll be working on, fit together. How we'll race the clock to execute our harvest initiatives, write the software, build the tech and the facilities. How we'll lock it down and seal it up before the inevitable occurs. But even more important, you'll know how it doesn't end here. How Gaia will generate those deactivation codes General Harris talked about, and build the transmission arrays to broadcast them, shutting down the Pharaoh robots for good. How Gaia will not just build, but imagine any conceivable robot it needs to do its work across centuries. From detoxifying the Earth's ravaged atmosphere and poisoned seas, to the regreening of the Earth from cryopreserved seed stalks, to rewilding the Earth with animal life. And then, when all that is done, how a new generation of human beings, 
spawned at cradle facilities around the globe will partake of Apollo. The vast archive of human knowledge and cultural achievement from which they will learn of us, our world. And most important, how not to repeat our mistakes. It's not an impossible dream. It is within our grasp if we work tirelessly and stop at nothing to achieve it. We can't stop life from ending. But if you will help me, help Gaia, we can give it a future. Join me and help make that future real. Whole Earth destroyed, but then remade. Yes, by a machine, a machine of creation. Elizabeth did this for life, for us. But why Hades then? If it was part of Gaia, how did it end up in the wreckage of a pharaoh robot? Why does it want to kill me? And Apollo, the archive of knowledge, what happened to that? I'm as confused as you are. Maybe the answers lie ahead. I wonder if there's any audio stuff. No. Oh, I see. They, they went out and got a whole bunch of people to work on this thing. Welcome to Project Zero Dawn. I am General Harris, Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the United... Already did that. All right. You've heard the bad news, and it's all true. The Pharaoh Plague is devouring the biosphere. Life itself will cease to exist. Global extermination. But does that have to be the end? What if we could give life a future? What if we could build a kind of seed from which, on a dead planet, life could blossom anew? This is the aim, the hope, of Project Zero Dawn. To create a super-intelligent, fully automated terraforming system. Okay. I think we already heard. basically that's the same speech he was given I keep thinking I'm gonna miss out on something if I don't go down and check every little place there he is If you're still nauseous. No, the inhibitors have kicked in. I can't feel the back of my tongue. I wish I could tell you I'd believe in this, but the damage is too great, too extensive, too complete. With all respect to Dr. Sobek's work at Miriam, no, no. Life doesn't always find a way to keep going. Sometimes it never comes back, like Syzygy East, like the Congo. Like Timo. Like us. 
is he to make sure I behave this time? Security, for your protection. <sighs> Would you like to discuss how you're feeling? Sure. I'll tell you. Surprised. No, flabbergasted. Like my old man would say, okay. flabbergasted. <laughs> that vein pumping in his forehead. I thought, I thought you people were just completely underprepared for a space flight pro. Yeah. Oh. Saving these for the trail. Intruder! Get her! Whatever you do, don't die now. Guys got these. I wonder if I can get back to where I left that one. Here it is. Now, two of us got these weapons. Power's down. Is there another route? I've done this before. Just need my focus. Wait. Okay. to find the right configuration. Hey, I'm done with Brett's incompetence, okay? Somehow, he managed to install an H-emitter node backwards. Everything's in reverse. 
I don't get paid to clean up Brett's messes. If you want it fixed, send him up to storage for a new emitter, not me. Parker out. So he said he installed everything backwards, huh? Right. Okay. Hey, I'm done with Brett's incompetence, okay? Somehow, he managed to install an H emitter node backwards. Everything's in reverse. I don't get paid to clean up Brett's messes. If you want it fixed, send him up to storage for a new emitter, not me. So I don't know this up. I don't know if that's if there's saying. Um, Done. I should check the door nearby. Fuse now. Hmm. Oh, it was it was up these stairs, right? These will keep. Okay, uh, uh, let's see. to the door. See, I can't do anything here. It's not giving me any kind of indicators. Should have brought a cart. Hmm. 
found one. Looks intact. Emitter. That should do the trick. Now let's get that door open. All right, so uh, I guess this is supposed to be down. And then this is supposed to go to the left. And this one is supposed to be up which is fine and then this one is supposed to go to the right and then this one is supposed to be down that did it door should have power now to see what lies beyond it Way. This way. Shoot. Eclipse. More They're gas. Here. Avoid contact. Lines look good. Gaia, it's up there. Second floor. Can you reach it? <sighs> so much for avoiding contact. The girl is sad. I gotta kill the Eclipse. I gotta figure out where they're at first. before the shadow.
shadow take you? Oh. Can't really see too good. Can't see her. Still sniffing around. You see anything? Or not. Well, shit, how many guys are there? You will perish! <sighs> I'm going to have to kill all these guys all over again. Yeah, shoot. Let me do this. Huh. Let me see some inventory. Hmm. 